have completed. Amen. Um, I mean, it, it was a long time coming. Uh, thank God, God gave me the vision for it, and I shared it with my wife, and she was like, sweetheart, are you sure this is a double <laughs> test you want to take on? And before you know it, we went on a fast, we saw God about it, and God put all the resources there, uh, the lenders there, all the builders, the realtor uh, there. Um, I think I want to put all to be the first place where we built our home, because God told me years ago to bless this place, to bless this city. And so this is the first house that we finally completed. Uh, yes. Glory. Woo! Woo! And then so before we do an open house, uh, our open house, I told God I want to make sure that we dedicate our property to him. Uh, this is all his work. You know, I'm, I'm nothing. I'm nobody. We're nobody. You know, I, I'm not even that great of a painter. You know? <laughs> uh, but uh, before I go on, I'd like to thank my wife for all the support she's given me uh, throughout this process, helping me, making sure people were in place. Uh, so, <laughs> staying in place. Um, again, I'd like to thank our realtor. She dealt with a whole life. She's gone. Above and beyond. The realtor. And she's been with us when we first came up with the idea. And now here it is. We have the first three homes that are pending completion. We have our own uh, property in Liberty, Texas. Uh, we're building uh, houses in Orange, Texas, and uh, it's like, it's going around and around. And I didn't even think that I would get built. <laughs> you know, so I thank God for this. Also, the prophet would say we're going to have homes in Oh, Lord. Yes, they are. That's all I was just saying. Oh, God. After yeah. Hurricane Harvey, you know, Mary, you know about that, like how hard <laughs> things were. Our house was flooded, our house where we lived at. And uh, we went to the service that next Sunday or whatever Sunday it was. And she said, God did this so you can have two houses. Well, we ended up with two houses, then three, then four, then five, then six, then seven, then eight. That exactly. works for property, property to different cities. She remember a little bit. to God. Yeah, she, she helps with all the prophecy memories. <laughs> it's just a blessing to see your faith. It's a blessing to see y'all faith and obedience in one another. Because you can prophesy all day, but when you're able to see the people doing the work and walking by faith, it's an honor for me to just watch you guys blossom it's so funny. and see all that you know. And what I heard when you were talking, you don't have to pay. Because y'all got the vision. The Lord says, you write the vision, and he send the runners. You miss that point. So he send the runners because you walking out the world and the manifest. You got runners over here. But that's what you're coming come to real estate. When you come to say, those are the runners. The construction people, those are the runners. Because they're trusting in what God has put inside of them. Man, yes. And I think I'm also mayor. He took time out of his business because I'm going to turn two different events today. Built up the city. I come at two of the events, and uh, this was the last minute thing. I just wanted to, you know, gather everyone together. And um, I called him around the time, and I was like, you know, I want to build out here. And he said, you know, whatever you need help with. Uh, and a couple of the council members, they said, whatever you need help with. And uh, I'd like to thank Dr. Moulton as well. Dr. Moulton, he saw the vision when I first started talking about it. What was that, two years ago? Two years ago, and he wanted to invest in the, in the vision. And on top of that, he's been on top of some of the people who went to. But anyway, so we got. They were behind the scenes. We're going to open up in prayer. Uh, Should I remind you this in prayer? <laughs> Dear Heavenly Father, Lord, first of all, we just want to thank you, Lord, for the vision that you have given us, Lord God. Allow you, first of all, give us the vision, Lord. You've given us prophecy to complete the vision, Lord. We just want to thank you, Lord, for even just being here today in your presence, Lord God. Yes. Lord, as we dedicate this house to you, we ask that whoever we will be, Lord God, that they will serve you this house many of days, all the days of our life, Lord Jesus. We love you, we praise you, Lord. We thank you for everyone that showed up today. I ask for a special blessing. Over everyone here today, Lord Jesus, and we'll ever serve and praise you in Jesus' precious and holy name. We pray. Amen. Amen. Amen.
our Savior's blood. Who died to set me free? Who died to set me free? It tells like me his precious blood. A sinner perfectly. Yes. Things for you. And, and, and besides this, these are homes that are made with love. Come on, somebody. So we thank God for you. We thank God for you. Huh? Yeah. Matter of fact, <laughs> yes, that's, that's right. Thank you so much. Yabaruka Kavi Shmirka. Yahya Adana Panavalika Vikunisa. Yisa Adana Panavalika by Yashemla Kashalom. May the Lord bless and keep you. May the Lord's face shine upon you and grant you grace. May the Lord turn his face towards you and give you peace. I can decree blessings upon this home. Amen. And so Amen. I'm just going to speak prophetically what the Lord said that the people are already ready. Amen. You're going to have to pick and choose between the properties as they grow from city to city and from state to state. I heard the Lord say. And you will have to build a New Orleans. Mm. <laughs> not a place you may not favor, but it's a place that you will build. And it's going to be a, a property to where it's going to be so grand that it will be where the old money will have to come seek the property, says the Lord. And so it's just going to grow and get great. I just thank God for you guys, yes, and for just watching you walk this out. In fact, we came when the prophecy wasn't prepared, so I'd love to come from the beginning again to see yes, the now. Yes. But all of you who are connected, my prayer is that you stay connected. Keep your ear to God's mouth. Watch for those who will try to come to throw seeds of discord as you grow. But remember these times, remember these moments. And for those who have played, played the Lord said, a financial seed into this, the Lord said, you just reap the blessing upon yourself mm -hmm. because you trust in God with the vision. There will be some doors that are open for you because you said yes to what God is doing for, for his prophet and for also his wife who's also a priest in the home. And so we just give God praise, glory, and honor on today. I speak over your life and speak over your health on today. And I come against any sickness you have to try to come against you. And you continue to walk with your head up high in this season. And be very careful when you connect to in this hour, says the Lord. And we just give God praise on today for what is done for the more and for the more blessing for the people who will come. There will be people who will grow and families will be burned out in these homes. And Father, we give you praise and we give you all the glory and we give you all the honor, God. And we pray, God, that you're lining up. We hear the Lord saying the Nehemiah's God. 
You're putting the tools in the hand that they need as they prepare to build. No one yes. will come to steal. Anybody that try to connect to them that's not a you with this mountain before you see that hands attached to, but God, you're bringing in those. God, you see in your heart in this hour. It's in Jesus' name. We pray. Even if the planet hits the land, it will not touch the finances. Hey, Lord, the God. God. Hallelujah. 
and it says, the heathen raged, the kingdoms were moved. He uttered the, his voice, the earth melted. The Lord of hosts is with us. And when he's with us, yea, go up to the valley to shadow that I will fear no evil while, for thou art with me. So when he's with us, we don't have to worry. It can look as bad as it can look. You can't see any good news, but if God is with us, it's going to rest assured that we're going to make it through it. It says, the Lord of hosts with us, the Lord of, uh, the God of Jacob is our refuge. Come, behold the works of the Lord. This right here, Dr. Levy didn't do this. Our builders didn't do this. If God didn't declare for this house to be built, it wouldn't have been built. The money wouldn't have been there. Doors would have shut, but God was in control. And we can look at man all we want. We want this door to open. God, the Bible says God opens doors that no, no man can shut. And God shuts doors that no man can open. I wouldn't think about all the doors that were shut at the beginning, but God gave the right door to open. Because if some doors would have opened that we wanted, it would have been to our favor. And it says here, Come, behold, words of the Lord, what desolations he had made in the earth. He maketh wars and cease unto the end of the earth. He breaketh the bow and cut the spear in sunder. He burned the chair with, with fire in the fire. Be still. That was the hardest part, y'all. Being still. Be still and know that I am God. And if you ask this Hebrew scholar, you will see, uh, you will see it says, and know Yahweh. Just God. Not the people. Don't worry about the people that are in place. If God is in the place, if God is dwelling with you, you don't need nobody else. As long as God is as long as I got King Jesus, I don't need nobody else. It says, be still. And when troubles rise up, be still. Let God fight things. Some things we can't do on our own. I can't, there's so many things I can't do on my own. It's only been by God's grace. Be still and know that I am God. I will be exalted among the heathen. Amen. Sometimes we have like plan B. If plan A doesn't work, yeah. we got plan B. If plan yeah. B doesn't work, we got C. plan C. God will allow plans A through Z to fail <laughs> and show that he's going to be God in the midst. And he'll show up and he'll be the only one that will be able to be exalted. So you won't be able to say your connections got you exalted. You won't be able to say that your friends on Facebook got you exalted. You won't be able to say that millionaire came to help you. But you can just give all the glory to God. And the Lord of hosts is with us. The God of Jacob is our refuge. And I just want to end the saying this. God has been with us. Every step of the way. And I, can, I just give God thanks and praise for what he's done. I give God thanks and praise for what he's doing. I haven't even announced half the stuff that we have going on behind the scenes. New Orleans. <laughs> uh, you know, more, like the... the the chance for multi-million dollar properties have come up. And we just we just have to sit back, be still. That was the word God just wanted me to share with all of you. Be still. If you're obedient already, if you you know, we sow, we sold our seeds already. If you've sown your seeds already, if you've done everything you know to do to take care of your health, if you said everything you need to say, if you called every person that you were supposed to call, at that point. If, Lord, if you don't do it, it just won't be done. And God's going to do it. Amen. God bless you all. And um, since we've got prophets, uh, Gina and I was just having to close out the prayer. And we'll be out of here. Father, we thank you. We thank you for being in the midst. We thank you for coming. We thank you for just allowing us to just sit in your presence one more again, Father. We never let this moment go unnoticed, Father. We thank you for what you have done with this family. We thank you for the seeds that have sown that is now coming to flourish and look like beautiful, beautiful trees and flowers that you are just flourishing up in the spirit realm. Father, we ask you to let this be um, one of many, Father, and many more to come. Families that would be blessed beyond measures, Father. And we thank you for the love and the gratitude that was given unto the works in your hands, Father. We ask you to bless them. And we thank you for everyone that came to support, to show the love, let the, let the prayers and the continuous support uh, go beyond even today, Father. We thank you in Jesus' name. Amen. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. 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 Jesus.